Peace. What's good, people? How y'all doing? It's the regular show. I'm Rex, your host. Um, what I want to talk about today is relationships and how it literally has to be 50-50. Like, all right, let's get into it. You got to be honest. Like, the number one thing people get fucked up about relationships is communication. Yes, that's important. But if the communication that you're having ain't honest communication, and y'all ain't about shit, and that shit ain't going to work, it shouldn't be hard to be honest with the person that you say you love, with the person that you wake up and go to sleep with every day. It shouldn't be hard. The person that you claim you want to build shit with and that you, you see a future with, and shit like that, you know what I mean? This is just real. This is just real talking. You gotta be honest. That's the easiest thing because if if the person you're with knows that they don't gotta double check anything you say, that they don't have to doubt anything you say, then y'all good. You are gonna get that real person. They gonna open up to you. They gonna be themselves. You know what I mean? A lot of people get it fucked up and think like, oh, because I've been with this one person for this long that we good and, and and we straight when y'all arguing over little petty shit and and and, and y'all doubting each other and you can't go nowhere and and miss a phone call without the person that just called you flipping the fuck out and thinking wild shit because they don't trust you trust communication being honest that's what it's all about and once you got that everything else is simple Because like I said, that person got no doubt about you. So that person knows that you standing on the truth. And you know that she's standing on the truth. So y'all ain't got no fucking problems. It's y'all two literally against the world. And that's another thing. People get so caught up in in social media and shit like that. And like, oh, look at me and whoever I'm with and shit. Like all these pictures. And like that picture is just a moment. Like literally just a moment. Like you set that up. You grab that person, say, come here, smile, boom. And then you put up a caption, oh, I love this person so much. We always smile and fuck the haters and shit. Look, stop worrying about everybody else. Worry about the people that worry about you. And that goes for everybody. That means celebrities, all that other shit. That's entertainment. A lot of people get caught up in the whole reality TV. And it's not even real. Like, all that shit is set up. All that shit is fucking... It's it's designed to draw you in and get ratings. It's designed to cater to your lowest self and 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 bring that out of you. Because if you if, if look just look at the look whatever show you watch reality TV VH1 MTV well those shows that you watch you know you know what I'm talking about love and hip hop all them shits go look up the trailer for next week's episode and I bet you it's fucking people fighting. People talking shit to each other. All that, like, that's, like, literally, if you watch that 24-7, how you think you're going to act? That's real shit. How you think you're going to act? You don't don't understand. Your subconscious is is impressionable. So if I sit at home all day, right, and I'm just watching basketball movies, and I'm watching basketball games and shit like that, what I'm going to want to do as soon as I get up and go outside? I'm going to want to go play basketball, right? Because I'm going to think I'm that dude that was just on TV scoring. I'm going to go do that. And it's not even like you thought about it. You got outside and boom. So if you watch reality TV and all that dead fucking TV shit, dead brain TV bullshit that everybody watches and everybody always talking about and, and, and you even got the people that star on the show, the people that are on these reality shows thinking that they're actually somebody. Like you got these reality stars thinking like you can't even stand in a room with a Will Smith. You can't stand in a room with a Leonardo DiCaprio. You can't stand in a room with a Denzel Washington. You know why? Because you're not a celebrity. They on a different, completely different level. They have talent. Let's put it that way. They have talent. Anybody can get on TV and act like a fucking idiot, Right? No, that's just what it is. That's talent. You can't stand in the same room. You can't hold a light up to them. You can't. Anyway, back to relation. That shit pisses me off. Reality TV, that shit really, like, I don't understand why people watch that shit. 
and then you got the people that watch the shit and then act like their favorite character on the show character because that's what it is that's not even the real person you're seeing that person don't act like that that person is portraying a certain character they need one that's a live wire they need one that's shy you know what i mean these are all characters it's not reality it's not reality simple as that <laughs> whatever this basically turned into a rant but this is what this channel is going to be about you know what i mean we're going to talk about real shit we ain't going to talk about stupid shit <laughs> that was stupid right there but you know what i mean like we're going to talk about real shit you know what I mean? Share the video, like and subscribe. You know, I'm going I'm to try to really build the channel, but the channel is going to be built on truth. The channel is going to be built on being able to express yourself and stand on truth and not worry about like, oh, I got to say it this way because this is the wave. I got to dress a certain, you know what I mean? All that shit. If you feel the same way as me, subscribe to my channel and we're going to start fucking with each other. I'm Regs. This is The Regular Show. Y'all be safe.